Good evening, this is Jill at Fabric Garden here in Sacramento, California. Thank you so much for joining us on our regular Thursday Facebook Live. As you can see, we have a beautiful quilt store here, but we also have a full online web store, uh, which the link to our store is in the description. It is fabricgardenquiltshop.com. So tonight I'm going to show you some new fabric lines we got in, some other new things that we got in. Uh, lots going on this week. So I thought I would revisit quickly um, the Cory Yoder Mystery Block of the Month. So it's a semi-mystery. We know how the quilt is set but the blank squares, the blocks are mysteries. So we did learn yesterday that Corey is planning to start the block of the month on Saturday, March 18th. And she will post the block patterns on the third Saturday of each month, starting March 18th and going for eight months. So there will be seven blocks and also the quilt. So as you can see, the quilt is done with a jelly roll. And I love how the blocks are going to be in a friendship star, but you can also see kind of a, a pinwheel in here too, which is a favorite of mine. Um, now is the time to get your kit for this. Um, the fabric is moving pretty quickly. Um, we're cutting these kits to order, but we can do four more. So the kit comes with a jelly roll. It comes with all the background fabric, and it comes with all the fabric for the blocks and for the binding. So um, the kit is everything for the top and binding. Um, we have had some people who are purchasing for additional borders and also their backing. So um, don't wait too long because we just have enough for four more kits for that. Okay, so let's talk about, we have a new fabric line and these are just a few of the pieces. This is from Riley Blake and it is called Portsmouth. And this is a patriotic line, but it is very soft. Um, the reds in this are a muted, I love them, they're, they're just gorgeous, these reds. So they're not dark reds, they're very soft and the blues are very soft. Um, so um, we do have coming in for this, we haven't received them yet, but we have a quilt kit coming. And I love the flags and I love that some of the flags, the star field is a solid star fabric, but all the others are different star blocks. So almost like a little sampler quilt with the stars. So um, I'm not sure when these will be arriving, but I would imagine they're not too far behind the fabric. So this will be coming in soon, the Portsmouth quilt kit. Um, should put that up for pre-order for you. I'll do that in the morning when I get back in. So Portsmouth is here and then we also got in and I'm just going to kind of hold this up. This or Julie can pan down to it even easier. This is from Marcus Fabrics. Uh, this is Pam Buddha and this is Plumberry and it ranges. It has lots of lights that have the plum and purple color in it. I love this little polka dot. And it goes from kind of a lilac all the way to a deeper eggplant. Uh, these are just lovely. I love this really dark one. So these are 1800 reproductions. And uh, this is the entire line of Plumberry. Um, you can order individual pieces, or if you give us a call, we can put together a fat quarter bundle or half yard bundle or one yard bundle of each of the fabrics for you. So uh, that is Plumberry. Uh, not on the table because we haven't even taken it out of the plastic yet, but we just checked in Moda's 
low volume neutral line called Mix It Up. So if you click the link in the description and go to our website, you can see all the SKUs of the Mix It Up. So Mix It Up, uh, the backgrounds range from a white to an off-white to cream, and they are almost a shirting or a low volume neutral. We do have layer cakes and jelly rolls coming from this, and we found a really cute free pattern for this, and it is called, let me see, Flea Market Linens, and this is a um, pattern that uses Moda's cake mix. And cake mix is one of my favorite products. This is sort of like triangle paper. I'm going to open this one. And you can see that unlike regular triangle paper, it has different size triangles. Now, there are actually 12 versions of cake mix. This is version two that is used in the pattern, and we have more of these coming. It's as simple as putting your background and your, in this particular pattern, uh, Bella Solid. And we do have this beautiful Bella Solid color coming in layer cakes, so you don't even have to cut it. It's all in layer cakes. You put them right sides together, put a sheet of the cake mix on it, sew on the lines, cut it apart and you can make these are just samples of the blocks you can make with this particular recipe but um, we were thinking it might be fun to put a class together for this for those of you who haven't worked with cake mix um, we won't be able to schedule it till we know for sure when our layer cakes are coming so we will once we have that we will get that scheduled so also in new is Lori Holt's newest quilt seed patterns. So the last ones were flowers and these ones are vegetables. So uh, these are the calico peppers and I love how she packages these. These are like a seed packet. Um, this is actually like a cardboard and look it's got this cute little like you feel like you're working in an office. And then the pattern is in there in full color. So it's such a beautiful presentation for a pattern. So there are, whoop, there are pumpkins, there are corn and peas, squash, Uh, root vegetables. Did I show? Oh, I guess those were peppers. That's a pumpkin. And tomatoes and cherry tomatoes. <laughs> so a very cute. Um, it's up to you how you want to set these to make a quilt. So you could use these to make a quilt, a table runner, wall hangings, uh, they're each individual patterns and you can mix and match them, put them together in your own way. So that is the brand new quilt seeds. Also from Riley Blake, we got in their little Riley Blake bird pins. So the pins have little blue birds on them, so cute and they come in a little bird house. They are so cute. Every time we have tried to order these, they're out of stock. So I had my rep on call to call me when these were back in stock. So we were able to get them ordered this time. The other thing we got in from Riley Blake is a nice little scissor and tape measure duo in a quilting style. Um, so these are just little embroidery scissors and a nice little tape measure and um, very cute gift for a friend. You know, it is Valentine's Day is still in front of us. You still could buy a cute little gift. 
And then it's always hard for us to keep these in stock, but also just new little cute pink polka dot embroidery scissors. So those are all new. And believe it or not, there is still more boxes here. <laughs> So I know for sure I've got an in the beginning line, but I'm really I'm going to try, I'll have them all open by next Thursday. So I was going to have Julie pan over. Uh, last week I showed you the brand new book panels and we got our little sample made up. This one is my first words, colors and numbers. And it's three little books. And it's so cute. They open up and somebody can count them. Uh, just nice and colorful and soft. Uh, the panel comes with the fabric to make this cute little bag and a cute little kitty to, to hold while you read. And those all will go in the little tote bag. We also got Bedtime Bunny made up. So it is all it is all ready, and these just make the cutest little, little books with bath time and pajamas and snuggles. It's very cute. And the other one, where is it? Is it hiding? Is it on the top? Oh, I see it. It's hiding. This one is... I gotta buy it's opening up on me. I love you even when you're crabby. And uh, I, I still even say that to my grown children. <laughs> so anyways, very cute little books uh, for the little ones in your life. They're soft, they're fun to snuggle with. And oh, one last thing. We do carry some cute cookie cutters in the store. And um, we do have this cute, we thought, oh, everybody has heart cookie cutters, but we have some lip cookie cutters for Valentine's. And it might be a little late, but we also have a, I forgot to bring it down, but I'll add it up to the website real quick before I go home. Um, we have a Jersey cookie cutter, so you could make a Super Bowl Sunday cookies and you could use your frosting and put your favorite colors of your team you're rooting for on the jerseys. So um, did I get it all? I think so. And there's even more coming next week. It's, it's like Christmas every day here at Fabric Garden. So thank you so much for joining us. Do you see any questions there, Julie? No questions. Okay. Well, you can always call the shop and ask questions or shoot us an email. And we will see you in the store or here live next Thursday. Thanks for joining us.